Pensioners in Ogun State have protested the non-payment of their 12 years gratuities by the state government, which is estimated at 68 billion naira. The senior citizens under the aegis of the Nigeria Union of Pensioners took off from their secretariat in Leme and marched to the governor's office in Okemosa Biokuta, blaming the governor for his failed promises to alleviate their sufferings through prompt payment of their gratuities and other entitlements. Speaking on behalf of the protesters, the chairman of the NUP, Comrade Wahid Oloyede, accused the governor of deliberately punishing pensioners by denying them of their entitlements. Addressing the protesters, the secretary to the state government, Tokumbo Talabi, assured the pensioners of a quick response to their demands. We are at the end, we are at the end of September 2022 and no release has yet been made. Added to the above is the reason that put late night in the release of monthly pension, which has been caused on top financial hardship to the senior citizen who spend all day on various old age ailments. It is an indisputable fact that the state internal general revenue has increased astronomically in billions over the years as relayed and reported on media on several occasions by the Commissioner for Finance. Yet, this never reflected in the party attachment of the regime pensioners. From the other it becomes obvious that His Excellency, Prince of the Dr. Abiyadu, MFR, is insensitive to our flag and is helping to sustain his nonchalant attitude towards the vulnerable. We are trying our best, this, this administration is trying its best to make sure that even the existing one, we meet them and we, are, we, we thank God for that. But I'm sure that with this thing now, everybody is seeing it. Um, His Excellency, if you have been around, you will have organized another, we have done it before, where you express yourself to His Excellency. But His Excellency is not around now. The only commitment that I can give to you is you, are, you have a legitimate right to make this demand. Nobody is going to say it is wrong. But when the Excellency comes back, as soon as he gets back, we will organize a team of five, six, sit with him, and from that meeting, we will also see what can be done. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.